In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a server for the brand new Copper Age update. So the first thing you want to do is you want to open up any web browser like you normally would. Then go ahead and look up Essential Mod just like so. And the Essential Mod is a free Minecraft mod that will allow you to host your very own servers and you can have all your friends join it. So please go to the official Essential.gg website. Now just for transparency purposes, the Essential Mod has a few limitations. For starters, it is not a 24-7 server. It is only going to work when you're hosting the game. And also, it can be very confusing and there's a ton of glitches as well. And you should only play the Essential Mod with people who you trust because whenever you host a server using the Essential Mod, the people who join your server can actually see your IP address. So you want to make sure that only people you know in real life trusted people actually do play with you. But if you guys want a simple solution that doesn't include any of those issues, consider checking out our partners over at Simple Game Hosting. Simple Game Hosting offers affordable and high quality Minecraft server hosting, where you're easily able to set up a 24-7 unlimited slot server for you and all your friends. With a simple game hosting server, you're able to explore and experience all the brand new features of the Copper Age update, and they make everything incredibly easy to set up with their dozens of video tutorials and 24-7 live customer support where a Minecraft server expert can walk you through the entire process start to finish. You guys can also add things like mods, mod packs, and plugins with the click of a single button. And at the moment, they're currently doing a sale where everybody who gets a Minecraft server gets 25% off their very first month of server hosting. So guys, if that sounds interesting, feel free to check out the link in the description down below and in the pinned comments. But anyways, all you want to do is you want to press on this download button right over here and wait for the essential mod to be installed. All right, once it's finished installing, go ahead and drag and drop the essential installer.exe file to your desktop just like so. It should look something like this from here. Go ahead and double click on it. And then from here, go ahead and select on Minecraft Launcher. And where it says select an installation, you want to go ahead and press on new installation right over here. And where it says Minecraft version, you want to select on Minecraft 1.21.9. Now I'm recording this video a couple hours before the update comes out. But by the time you watch this video, Minecraft 1.21.9 should already be released and you can go ahead and select on it. For this video, I'm just going to be working with Minecraft 1.21.8, but remember, the process is going to be the exact same thing even when the update comes out, except instead of selecting on 1.21.8, you're going to select on 1.21.9. But anyways, from here, all you want to do is you want to press on Create and Install Essential, just like so. Then afterwards, once it says installed, you can go ahead and close out of the Essential Installer and open up the Minecraft Launcher like you normally would. All right, once you're in the Minecraft launcher, please make sure that Java Edition is selected, then go to the top menu over here to where it says installations, and where it says versions, please make sure that the box that says modded is actually turned on, because this is technically considered a modded version of Minecraft. But then eventually you should see the essential mod appear in this list, and all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on play, press on I understand, then go ahead and press on play just like so. Okay, once you load it into Minecraft, you will now notice that you'll get this brand new menu. So basically, the way it works is that you and all your friends need to have the Essential Mod downloaded for this to work. So please send this video to your friends so that they're able to know exactly what to do. But all you want to do from here is you want to go ahead and press on social just like so. Then you want to go ahead and press on this button that says add friend and type in the username of your friend right over here. Then you want to press on add and that is going to send a friend request to your friends and all they need to do is just accept it and then they are good to go. All right, now let's actually host our server. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on host just like so. Then you guys could load into a pre-existing world or create a new one entirely. And you just want to go ahead and press on next, press on don't show, then go ahead and press on proceed. Then you guys could configure the world settings over here, change the game mode, difficulty, etc. Then go ahead and press on next. And then from here, you're able to go ahead and invite all your friends. Then go ahead and press on host world. All right, guys. So here we are in our world. And just to reiterate, if you want to invite your friends, go ahead and press on invite. And then they will appear right over here. You can go ahead and reinvite your friends if you need to. And once your friend received your invite, all they need to do is accept it. And then they're able to go ahead and join you in the server. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.